Hi, everybody. Michael Casey here with Bainline. I'm here at the Experience Center in Winter Park, Florida. Today, we're going to talk to you a little bit about podcasting, how easy it is, and uh, what you need to get started. So a couple of the important things you need to get started with podcasting are, uh, number one, obviously a microphone. Uh, you need something to pick up your voice, something to be heard. And then uh, you may also need a interface or a mixer, such as this ZI series I have here from Allen & Heath, and a computer. Today I've got this shirt MV7, which is modeled after the SM7B. They make everything from these up into uh, professional broadcast studio microphones, live performance wireless microphones. The MV7 here is uh, made particularly for podcasting. One of the coolest things about this MV7 is a revolutionary new feature. It's a dual output functionality. It's got XLR output, just like a standard broadcast microphone. It's also got a USB connection that'll connect straight to your computer. So you've got two options. Uh, you can carry this microphone around if it's just you recording a podcast or a voiceover. You can plug a USB cable straight into your computer. Simple workflow that you can throw into your bag. And it's got a headphone jack, so you can plug your headphones right in here. Very simple workflow one device and you're ready to roll, ready to podcast. For instances where you need more than one microphone, maybe a mixer is right for you. If you're doing something more scaled, you can do, uh, you can plug multiple microphones via XLR into a mixer interface like this uh, Allen & Heath ZI8 that I have here. You can bring all your microphones back in. We can plug our microphones directly into these channels. And as you move down the mixer, you have a few features. You have gain to adjust your level coming into the mixer. You have some EQ to adjust the tone. And uh, you've got a level fader here so you can adjust your main mix that's going out to your computer, your speakers, uh, your main output. There's also a few other features that might be interesting to uh, performers. There's some uh, guitar inputs. You can uh, plug a guitar into these channels. There's some uh, stereo line level inputs as well. One of the coolest features of this ZI8 is uh, it's, it's like a standard audio mixer that you'd see in a performance venue. But uh, what you can also do, it's got a USB connection. It'll plug straight into your laptop. This will send uh, two-way audio to and from your laptop. So it's very easy to record, very easy to uh, play back. We've got a couple XLR outs here. They can go to a PA system if you're doing a live performance or if you have a live audience for your podcast. It can also go to some studio monitors if you need some monitoring. So that's the uh, ZI8 from Allen & Heath. So a couple of the other accessories I have here for my uh, podcast setup. I've got some uh, headphones, some high quality. The Shure SRH 440s here, a uh, nice pair of stereo headphones plugged into my ZI8 mixer. These are really great for monitoring the live recording of your podcast because you really want to hear if there's any noises or uh, anything that you might not hear in your typical consumer earbuds. And these things will pick it up with some nice full range quality audio. Uh, I've also got the um, K&M boom arm. This is really great to keep your hands free, keep the microphone out of your hands reduce handling noise, things like that. It clamps onto a table, it's adjustable, you can pretty much put it anywhere. Thanks for watching. Uh, we've talked about how to set up a podcast from scratch with a microphone, uh, adding in a mixer interface and a laptop. Uh, if you need any more info on any of these products, feel free to reach out to us today at mainlinemarketing.com.